Welcome to Mobile, Alabama. The 2022 Senior Bowl is kind of a week-long job interview. This is a very important part of the draft process. Yeah, this is great. Getting to watch football. Prospects. How the transition been for you? Crazy, fast and furious. Yeah, I'd like to see if they let him snap here. Uh-oh, a little underneath that one. Just get me on the field in the corner. Let me watch the ball. How you doing, man? I'm Joe Shane. I'm with yes, the Giants. Sir. Have you guys seen the Southern kid at all? Central Michigan guy. Did you guys talk to the Washington State kid at all? San Diego State. It's good to be here doing this. And bar your stopwatch. It's your guy. He's tough, he's strong. He had some nasty to him. Coming in hot. I liked him a year ago. Your guys fly around, play the right way. That. I'm telling you, I enjoyed watching your defense. Some players here today that I've, I've watched on film, but I haven't seen them in person to see them move around. And, and some players have good weeks, and uh, you know maybe they don't play the best competition, and you get to see them step up in competition. So it's very important across the board just see how guys compete, uh, what type of shape they're in. You know, some people haven't played you know football in a month or two, so uh, you can kind of tell you know how serious they take it and how their process is. Hall of Famer right there. Glad to be here doing football stuff. I'm like, I get it. This guy's good. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of scouts here in terms of our personnel staff, so you know, I like to stand on the sideline. I can kind of hear what the coaches are teaching the guys, who's responding, how do they treat the trainers when they need water? Hey, give me water, or they, hey, can I please have, you know, I mean, you're just paying attention to everything, how they treat people, and then to me at night, the interviews are very important, really getting to, to dig into these kids and figure out who they are as uh, people. Just being around the guys as much as you can, so you know, again, we're making major investments into these players that, that we know everything that we, we can about them. Fordham, anybody go see him? Isn't that close to the facility? He's strange. I like his face mask. He's got the old school. No gloves. I noticed that on uh, film. I didn't notice the no gloves, but I noticed the old school face mask. I was just thinking Chris Paul, this Tulsa kid. So Chris Paul, Isaiah Thomas at Oklahoma, and Kobe Bryant at Cincinnati. Like on the scouting trail this year. Scouted a Kobe Bryant, Isaiah Thomas, and a Chris Paul. In it together, building it together. We'll okay. come up with a plan and try to see it through the best we can. Saw him plays. I don't know how fast he is. I told him, I said, we need 100 guys like you. Yeah. Same attitude, same ability. Fast and furious, man. Look at him. Lord have mercy. Are those implants? Oh, just smart, tough, and dependable. You know, guys that are smart, tough, and dependable, that care about football, that care about their teammates. You know, it's not so much about the glitz and the glamour that comes with it, but, you know, have some leadership to you when maybe things aren't going wrong or teammates aren't doing it well. You know, somebody that'll kind of right the ship and, and get the team heading back in the right direction. So, you know, those are the type of players that we're looking at. It makes all of our lives easier if you don't have to, you know, your whole support staff doesn't have all hands on deck to get somebody to do things the right way. So the more of the guys that we get that buy into the culture and are, are all, you know, have the common goal of winning a championship in mind and through our process, you know, paying attention to that on a daily basis, the better off we're going to be.